Okay, we will start the third session with those of us who are here to participate. Uh, we've shared some thoughts on why participation seems necessary and how participation can be enabled and some of the barriers and also some of the risks of that participation. And at this point, we're going to look towards the future and what's possible. So we can begin with the first speaker. Dear friends, my name is Jari Pardanen. I'm State Secretary from Finland. Mr. Chair, let me begin by thanking you for giving me this opportunity to speak here in this important forum. What does the future hold for participation is a general question when we are discussing about open government and better policy making issues. My sh short speech is based on three different parts. First is introduction to this theme, second concerns active citizenship, and third participation in local and global level. Dear friends, the pace of change in today's world is escalating. We have great possibilities to make information technology serve participation in new ways. However, there are threats as well. We need to ensure that we are not just building new fancy ways for elites to participate. We need to pay particular attention in developing the participation possibilities of the society's most vulnerable groups like children, elderly, and immigrants. In Finland, we have this as a commitment in our open government action plan. There is also an advisory board of our Minister for Civil Society organizations with the specific emphasis on digitalization in everyday life now, the active citizenship. In participation, the trend needs to be to find the way from consultation to a broader civic dialogue. It poses challenges not just for good governance, but also for active citizenship and civic society. One key test is that we listen and try to understand each other, but to facilitate that, we also need to, be, need to try to be understandable. If we use language that is not clear, or if our government function is too complicated ways, we cannot accept people to participate. Developing participation is to large extent also a global and global, global question. In our government work in Finland, we have the whole public sector involved. Wicked problems do not respect boundaries. Therefore, the solution and the participate paid towards the solution need to be global. Dear friends, openness and participation needs to be our core values also in the future. Participation should continue to have a strong legislative pace in the future. Thank you.